we've reached the conclusion of the 2023 IBJJF European Championships. It was all black belt action all weekend long, and we've got a ton of stories we need to cover. First up, Kainan Duarte. Double gold, all submissions, flawless front goal. Kainan looked absolutely impeccable. He submitted all seven of his opponents on the weekend, most of them with arm bar, the cross collar show, real fundamental techniques. An important note, this is Kainan's very first absolute major title as a black belt, also his first title at super heavyweight. We had another double gold champion in Gabby Pisania, who's looking to repeat her double grand slam from the 2022 season. Yeah. It's worth noting that Gabby Pisania beat Toledo Lima in the absolute final in a much more competitive match than their first go around. This win makes Gabby Pisania a four time European champion. Gabby Pisania, all submissions on the weekend. Speaking of athletes with 100% submission rates, Tynan Dalpera came back to Euros for his second title at Black Belt here and defeated all of his opponents by submission. Andy Murasaki is another black belt champion worth highlighting. The lightweight champ looked absolutely incredible, showing off a variety of techniques, great passing, top pressure, and a couple of incredible arm triangle finishes as well to cap off his championship run. Speaking of first time European champions, Jansen Gomez won the middle heavyweight category. That makes his first major title as a black belt. Another first time champion is Malachi Evan from TLI. Malachi took second at the 2021 World Championships at Diego Pato, lost by submission. He was able to rectify that result today with a strong showing and win by four points. Of course, two athletes who've been dominant for the last couple of years at Euros kept their streaks alive. Maisa Bastos won her fourth consecutive title here at Euros, and Ana Rodriguez, A-Rod, won her third consecutive title here. Longtime super heavyweight competitor, Felipe Andrew, moved down to heavyweight and collected his fifth title here at Euros. That's the bird's eye view of what went down on the final day of competition here at the European Championships. Check out flowgrappling.com for all the info, stories, and matches you need to see.